Hi. Uh, thank you for uh, tuning in um, to my video today. Um, I guess I originally started this channel um, to kind of show um, some good deals, some things that I found from the outlet, some things that have been a little hard to find, um, and also things that um, I don't see a whole bunch of reviews on or um, a lot of information about online. So um, this is just my way of kind of, you know, sharing some of the goodies I got and um, hopefully you can find them as well. <clears throat> so obviously if you tune on this video, you know that uh, this is going to be an unboxing of the Rogue, the Empire Rogue 25 from the Best Yacht Collection. I also wanted to share um, a couple of other goodies that I've received within the past week or so. Um, one being this uh, very hard to find key charm. So uh, one of the lovely ladies in my Facebook group um, was selling this and I was able to snap up one. And so I don't remember seeing these online. I know I saw it on the UK's site. Um, it's relatively big. Um, so, you know, if I kind of put this, well, my head is big too, so I guess, <laughs> I guess you won't be able to understand or see the reference or the size of it, but um, it's fairly large, right? So once you see it against, let's say, this is, um, a zippy pouch so it's fairly large but it looks really good um, on my rogue 39 that uh, one of my other girlfriends was able to snag for me so um, I'll be using this on that let me see if I can get you the tag information Ugh. so I don't even know if I'm doing that right or if you can see it if you can't, I apologize. But um, again, Coach does a really good job with their details. And you can see it has Coach stamped there. It has a little tag here that says Coach. Um, and that it's made in Vietnam. It says Vietnam back here. I don't know if you can see that or not. And then it has down here at the bottom, it says coach um, times, and it has the crown motif from the Jean-Michel Basquiat collection. And then it has um, the estate information down at the bottom. Really nice. Um, so thank you to her uh, for allowing me to purchase this. I've also picked up um, another piece from the Disney collection. So I think maybe about a week ago, Coach Outlet, their site, um, dropped some more um, items on clearance. And so I was able to snag this um, ID holder with Tiana on it. And as you saw just a few moments ago, I also have this piece. I mean, now, you know, given my age, right? <laughs> um, I just wanted a little something. So when I was going into work full time, I did have um, an ID holder that I used. And I think I purchased this from Amazon. It's been used so much that most of the words here have faded, but, um, there's my ID. And in the back of this part, I have my Metro Pass. So whenever we do actually go back full time, this will be a really cute addition. And I think it, I don't remember how, what the percentage off was, but um, it was about 23, 25 bucks. Definitely no more than $25. So I was happy to add that. And my daughter's already eyeing it. So I'm going to see 
I'm going to keep an eye out to see if they um, have more of these and um, see if I can snag her one too. So let's get to the main reason you guys are here. Um, and that would be this beauty, right? So I don't currently own any Rogue 25s. Um, initially, I just thought, you know, it's way too small for me and I've only purchased the size 30. I, I recently went into, not recently, um, some months ago, I went into a store and tried on some of the new Rogues that were just released. Um, and I tried on a green one that had the thicker strap that came along with it. And um, I really liked that it had that option. It made carrying this size bag um, just a lot easier to use, right? So when this collection was dropping these bags, I, it wasn't an instinct to pick it up because again, I don't normally use <laughs> nice, right? I don't normally purchase the size 25s, but after speaking to one of my girlfriends um, in our group, she said I would really like it because I like the coach Cassie and the Cassie um, is one of my go-to bags now for the summer. So I thought I would go ahead and give this a chance. So this is the Empire Rogue 25 from Basquiat's collection. Um, they had a couple of other ones, but to me, their offerings were all neutral. So like the elm color with the Pez on it, um, I don't really need the famous 25 because I have the famous 39. Um, and to me, I justified this purchase because the um, design on it is different than the 39 that I have back there. So um, <clears throat> this, this painting, um, I believe it was called Mecca and it was painted in 1982 from Basquiat. Um, but again, you know, Coach just does a really good job with the details. So this is the front. A lot of people from the various Facebook groups, I'm in several, they've picked up this bag. And I mean, for, what was it, 60% off? It's just amazing. To me, it's amazing. Because you have some famous artwork merged with um, a fashion house. Um, and a brand that does leather goods very, very well. Um, they leave no details undone. So even as I look at these two little buttons, here are these pins, they say coach on them. They both say coach. The feet down here at the bottom on the sides of it, they all say coach. I mean, Coach really does a really, really, I know I say this a lot, they do a really good job with the details and the finishing touches, and they brand everything. These back here have Coach on it. These rings here have Coach on it. Um, so here's the hang tag. Not the hang tag. <laughs> here's the price tag. And um, so you see the Mecca painting here on the front. This back here I thought was really cool because it looks like a postcard. I'm not exactly sure where that's from, but um, after doing you know some more research and um, learning more about his art and um, you know how he used this trademark symbol here a lot, I just think that it's you know it's really cool. So this is the side of the bag. I know my ring light is really bright. I just want to make sure that you all can kind of see the details. And here's the other side. And so I also love like this little pop of pink right here. I may find a pink um, bag charm to go along with this. 
Here is the hang tag, front and back. And so when like, you know, kind of considering this bag and saw that, you know, a lot of people were grabbing this from the outlet, Coach's Outlet website, um, then I started to see all of the items that started to pop up on um, the resale market, meaning, was it Macari? No, I didn't go to Macari. I went to Poshmark, I went to eBay, and I went to, um, it wasn't Tradesy, where was it? The Real Real. How people are selling this bag that was about 300 and some change, they've upsell it for you know up to eight hundred dollars which you know i really have my feelings about you, you never know what people are going through and the reasons that they do the things that they do but i just think that it's so unfair because we as you know lovers of the brand or of good fashion and or you know quality pieces for a really good price i just think it's unfair because some people weren't able to grab this so it came with a dust bag it came with this thicker strap which to me is the game changer and why i think it's going to be a great crossbody bag i'm just going to take the stuffing out now i'm sure you all have seen what these um what the rogue 25 can hold <clears throat> I'm just gonna show you what I would put in it. And this is so funny because it's like a little baby bag. So if I was going to work, I would have my ID tag, which takes up no space. I'd have my wallet, which you all have seen before. I would have my coach key holder. I also have another set of keys um, that I use for my car that I don't attach to this, um, but that really doesn't take up any space either. Sometimes I would carry my uh, planner, which is really small. So let me just show you, it's not hard to put in. I'm just trying to, I like to line things up so that they have like their own section. Hand lotion. My T'Challa uh, lip smackers. And so I'll show you how it looks now. <clears throat> so there's my planner. The lotion is sitting kind of on top of my wallet. Those are my keys. And so I thought, and I was wrong, um, I thought I would be able to fit my Neverfull pouch in here. And I guess I probably could, no, I cannot. Um, so no, that's not gonna fit. It's not. I do carry this sometimes if I have a larger bag. It house um, some wipes for my glasses. I have um, Tic Tacs. I have um, an ink pen, hand sanitizer, um, eyeliner or lip liner. So just some odds and ends. I don't carry this daily. But if I had a larger bag, I would probably throw this in as well. But for now, just for kind of run, running out, this is really all that I need. And so while, yes, it's larger than the Cassie, um, it's, all, it's also heavier than the Cassie. But I love it. So I love the handles. I'm guessing this is the color Elm. I think that these straps here, I'm just gonna take them and store them because I wouldn't put this under my shoulder. And it's exactly the reason, well, part of the reason why I never purchased the 25 before. So I would only use a crossbody or handheld. So that's really it. I mean, most of you all have seen this bag already. I just wanted to show it again. Um, I guess the only other thing that I may put in here because my daughter has allergies is a little pack of like the dollar store tissue. 
but that takes up no space, right? So I just threw that right on top. Oh, well, let me show you how the hang tag that uh, my buddy got for me. Let me show you how that looks on here. So I like matchy matchy. For me, this is too matchy matchy. I'd rather have this on the 39 Rogue because it covers up too much of the artwork. So, but this is how it, it looks on a Rogue 25. Almost the same size, right? <laughs> well, length. Okay, well, that's pretty much it. I just wanted to show you my new bag, my new um, key charm, and my other little, I don't know where I threw it, <laughs> uh, my other um, ID holder. So I did get a request to style some of the uh, Target dresses that dropped over the weekend. You all know I'm not really good with videos. Um, I just want to kind of show you things and give you my little two cents, you know, for what it's worth. Um, so I'll try that. I don't know how it's going to work out. I'm going to try it. I was able to grab several dresses from the Alexis and the Christopher John Rogers collection. Um, and then I went into the store yesterday to pick up something totally random. And I found, who was that? I think that may have been another Christopher, Christopher John Rogers dress that um, I have nowhere to wear it. <laughs> But it looks so good on. To me, it does. I guess that's all that matters, right? So um, I'll try to do that video soon. We'll see. Oh my gosh, I did this whole video. I don't have earrings on or anything. I have on my Hogwarts shirt. Forgive me, okay? Um, I was trying to hurry up and do this video before the puppy came home. So anyway, <clears throat> if you have not had a chance to get this bag, they may pop up again, um, either online, but definitely in the store. So uh, if you haven't or you can't find anything online, either call customer service or call your local coach store to see if they um, got any returns. Uh, I don't know when they're going to go back to 70%. You know, that would be even better, <laughs> right? Uh, but call customer service to see if any stores has this bag and then maybe you can pay for it over the phone if this is your thing if not you can admire it from afar so thank you for tuning in i hope this was helpful to somebody um and i'll see you guys next time bye